Do, 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 boop. Hi. How are you guys doing this morning? Good morning. Mm -mm -mm. We're picking our mythic path today. Pretty excited. Hey, Zydus. Am I gonna go through? Am I gonna go through all the mythic paths? Uh, we took a look at them last night, and I'm I'm pretty dead set on Angel. Our build is also assuming we're going Angel with the buff perks that we're getting. So, yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure we're going Angel. Uh, no, Stephen Mack, you don't actually pick your Mythic Path until now. Yeah. Hey, Miss Chaotica. How are you? One second. Oh Lord, what just happened? Okay. Um... Okay, we're good. Yeah, Barry, I think it is too. We're really encumbered. I need to figure out how to, what I'm going to do about that. The legendary banner of the Crusaders is right in front of you. A drop of blood falls onto it from where? The wound on your chest must have reopened and is now bleeding again. What we did last night, by the way, for anyone just tuning in or that, didn't, that wasn't here for the cozy stream, uh, we cleared out the bottom of the dungeon. We're going to go back in there because we have one more thing to do. And we are going to... And, and we found the banner and we're now at the very top of the ramparts. You touch Amade's holy banner to brush away the scarlet droplet when you freeze abruptly. All of a sudden, you're aware of your own power. You are no longer a grain of sand resisting the countless armies of the abyss. You are something greater. Like Amade once rejected her humanity to ascend and gain divinity, you are ready to take the first steps on the path to gaining power. But what will your power look like? So we can go Angel. That gives us some fun healing stuff and some extra fortitude as well as some spell resist uh, stuff there, which is great. Azata, which lets us summon a dragon companion and also have superpowers, which are kind of fun. Demon, which gives us demonic rage. We also get demonic aspect and demon claws, which is kind of awesome. This is a, a whole like fun class in itself. And then we have Trickster, which can find creative uses for all of their skills. They get mythic tricks, which is interesting, and sneak attacks and stuff, which is pretty cool. So. We're gonna go Angel. Now, in terms of our build, PF build, um, I think we are starting. Here we are. Yeah, we're getting ranging shots. Make sure to go over Angel spells, amazing defenses, buffs, and spells that hinder demons' life in general. Okay. Cool. So we're gonna do ranging shots, which is gonna be super helpful. <clears throat> mythic spell book. At the third rank, the angel receives the ability to cast mythic spells. He can either choose to take it as part of an existing full divine spellcaster spell book or a standalone spell book. Cool. Oh! Wound on your chest closes and the drops of blood spilled on the Sword of Valor burst into transparent flames. A wave of fire rushes out from the blood and across the entire banner, transforming it and emblazoning it with new colors. Power descends upon you, suffusing your mortal body, remaking it in its image. Coblas. It fills your body up to the brim, breaking bones and tearing muscle while at the same time healing them. 
You raise your head, acutely aware that the bright light of heaven will be at your back from now until eternity. Light is perfect for fighting demons. Camellia's gaze is piercing, it? as if she's trying to read your mind. This is just how I imagined the crusade would be. I'd enlist again right now if I could. You give all of us hope, right when many are already despairing. You are truly a messenger of heaven. What an interesting turn of events. Such intriguing power. Boy, if you should suddenly expire, I would be happy to dissect your remains. I'm pretty sure that's like one of the biggest compliments we could get from her. Um, I think. Maybe. Uh, let's see. Do, do. I have some VIPs to deal with. I'm sorry, chat. Oh, Renea! Thank you so much, Renea. You beat me to it. Now is not the time to linger. We can reflect on events later. Now is the time to act. to turn my ideas into reality. I still have things to do in Canopris, but you must leave. Dude! In the field laboratory, I have a special task for you. The laboratory? I hate that foul place. But I dare not disobey you, my lady. I wonder how many other times she's been like... Forgive me this little masquerade. What? What? Oh my god, is this Erelu? And she's the one that let us get the banner? Before, I am Erelu Vorlesh, also known as the architect of the world wound. Yo, she's got a cut like we do. There's something off about the stranger's appearance, like you're seeing only half a painting or looking at her with one eye closed. Her silk dress and expensive jewelry are at odds with a set of unfamiliar tools and her ink-smudged hands. We've met before. I'm Erlu Vorlesh. What are we meant to discuss with one of oh the key God. figures in our enemy's army, I wonder? Oh, Lady Arilu. I, Nenio, am ah! my most devoted admirer. Your research is an invaluable contribution to the development of science on Galarion. And this experiment with a world wound is simply groundbreaking. May I please have your autograph? One look from Erilu, and Nenio falls silent. You handle the power of the Sword of Valor well. Such artifacts are almost like living creatures, and they react to their own kind, shall we say. The Sword of Valor once belonged to a mere mortal who became a goddess. It seems to see something kindred in you. Touching you has left the sword irreversibly changed. Now it is your banner, not Iomidae's. Although perhaps it will still stop the demons from teleporting to the city as before. What happened to Yaniel? The Yaniel you freed from the dungeon was merely a mask. Sometimes I like to wear the guys Oh dude, this means Staunton was right. To study them from the inside. The real Yaniel has been gone for a oh, long man. time. But unfortunately for her, not permanently. 
Her lot is far more frightening than the one I showed you. Perhaps you will learn the truth one day, but for now, it isn't necessary. Huh. You've helped me twice already, in Canabras when we fell into the caves and here, pointing the way to the Sword of Valor. Why would a half-demon Discari's favorite ever do such a thing? Because she's 4D chessing us, obviously. I'm creating something. Building. Studying how the land lies. Laying the foundation. I am called the Architect for a reason. You don't deserve the name. Architects are creators. They build things. What have you created? A hole between the worlds? A wasteland in place of a flourishing country? Millions of deaths? You are no architect. You are nothing but a vandal. I create... How shall I explain it to you? Events. Phenomena. Concepts. My building site is the entire multiverse. You wouldn't call an architect a vandal just because he started by digging some foundations, would you? Now be silent. I'm not talking to oh you. I'm not asking you to trust me. That would be unforgivably stupid. But I suggest just... Good be oh hell yeah. ...that you search. Analyze. Think. What happened in old Sarkoris? What is the world wound? What is happening to you? Search for your answers. And for now, farewell. Mercer says, think, Co, think! <laughs> I'm trying, Mercer, but my brain did not work. Okay. Um, so I think we can go back down, right? Are we are we in combat? Oh we are. Be gone, fiend! Oh god, they're all they're all popping. Okay. So I'm pretty sure we can we're gonna be coming back up here. Let's drop everything here. Oh my god, we have so much weight right now. Drop all this. Drop all this. Drop all this. Yo, where's the scavengers guild when you need it? Just throwing that out there. Um drop all you, drop all you, drop all you, drop all you. Looking at you, Salasta. Drop all you. Drop all you, drop all you. Ooh, daggers, those aren't too heavy. Uh drop you. Drop you. Drop all you. Okay. Oh my god, we leveled two. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go back to the dungeon. No, leave all leave all that there. Yeah, there we go. Did I defeat the big daddy demon? No, we're actually going to do that now. Yeah. Bye bye Pi says, I think this is Ko's game of the year now. Actually, bye bye Pi, you're my game of the year. Yeah, so I, I don't I don't I don't know how that's gonna work, to be honest. Oh. I was like, why is it so dark? Beautiful. Uh we're over here. I'm gonna camp on this. I wanna I wanna barbecue us. Oh my lord, dude. Okay, let's take a look here. What is even life? Okay, um, I wanna take this off because that looks so ridiculous in the cutscene. Take that off. Um, I don't think this this doesn't do anything for us, does it? All your summon creatures gain the effects of greater launcher. Oh, actually, yeah, that's true because we use this. Okay. Apparently, we got a spell book or something. Okay, we have Sword of Heaven. That's awesome, but. I get to use it, is it per round? How long does it last? I'll have to test that. Um, I'll have to test that. What is this? Smith spell, we'll put that over here. Here is uh, an angelic halo. Each ally within 50 feet of the angel 
gains a bonus equal to half the angel's mythic rank plus one to ac and saving throws against attacks made by evil creatures well that's awesome okay that's fantastic renea thank you so much for conquering the vip scourge today i really appreciate it special shout out to you Ren. thank you so much okay so we're gonna we're, this is gonna be what level 10 i'm here all no wait do you have a spell book now Yo. Okay. Um, you can get divine favor. Cool. Put that on Co. Um, we can give him a heal, which would work well with some of our other stuff. Now I don't know what we want to do here. We can give him restoration lesser, which would be good, of course. But uh. He's going to be attacking, so we don't necessarily want Evo spells. Aid could be kind of good. Yeah, we don't want to be giving him, like, Arrow of Law. He, he's not hes not a caster at all. So, what is this? This prayer, you provide a long-lasting sucker to wound a creature. For as long as the effect of the target receives plus two morale bonus and same thing as fear and death. Anytime the spell is in effect, the target can choose to end the spell with a switch action for a burst of healing. Oh. The ca I guess, would the caster level be my... Uh, angel, this is it right here, right? This is my caster level. So it'd be 1d8 plus 6 per caster level. Uh, I mean, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Um, I kind of want to give him this, though, because we could... If we use this and then our angel form or whatever, this guy, then we'll heal for like 4d6 with that, which is kind of good. An additional two dice. Um, wouldn't that be okay against fear? It would be. It'd be good against fear. Yeah. Is it per... Well, how long does it last? Hold on. Here. One minute per level. Okay. And with our with our enhanced... Uh, we do have this on him, too. So... Well, longer than an hour. We, we're probably going to make that greater enduring spells eventually, I'm guessing. Go pop that on. You can pop that on. More effective than lesser restoration. Uh, now we have this. Okay, we can get... Oh, what is this? Grant Repose. You make a touch attack against any undead creature. If it fills, fails a will saving throw, it is immediately destroyed. If the target succeeds, it's dealt 2d6 damage plus 1 damage per 2 caster levels. Okay. Ward against disease. The target gains immunity to diseases for 10 minutes per caster level. Shield from the demon kind. For one minute per caster level, anytime the target is attacked by a demon, the demon is dealt 1d6 points of damage plus one damage. Additionally, the target gains deflection AC. Oh. Oh, I feel like this is pretty good. Archon Zora is good too. We'll give him, we'll give him an Archon Zora. And a shield from Demon Kind. Okay. I think we're gonna have to try like a few of these. Okay. Anyway. Oh, we and we might level. This may level him up. Okay, so let's let's go ahead and start putting this stuff on here. You're gonna go over here. You're gonna go over here. Uh, let's put all this stuff at the end. Alright. Let me bring up my handy dandy leveling thing. Okay, so we are on level 10. So we want divine anathema. An improved abundant casting. Okay. I like both these things. Ooh, we get an advanced talent. Um, oh, okay, okay. At 10th level, if the study target alignment is at least two steps. Oh, this is when we get the big slayer ability. Dude. Awesome. Okay, good. Uh, we're going to do boom, boom, boom. More perception on him. Great. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. All right, we'll start with our boy, Regal. Orders, Commander. Um, I think we're still doing... Oh, we can do Dragon Disciple with him. Look at that. Uh, Mr. Regal. Or you. Okay. We've got a few spells we can pick from. Rage Power, Animal Fury, and Defensive Stance. 
can power it. Oh, wait, no, that's not it. We're, we're up here for this. Okay, uh, Rage Power Animal Fury. Let's see. Uh, uh, is this, is, is this what we're doing? What is this? Oh, 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 we're switching it. So we're getting Animal Fury and Defensive Stance. We're doing this. Okay. Interesting. Animal Fury. When raging, the Barbarian gets a bite attack. If used as part of a full attack, the bite attack is made of the Barbarian's uh, full bab minus five. If the bite attack hits, it's 1d4. Plus half the Barbarian's strength modifier. That seems really weak, but maybe it's for something else later. It's interesting. Um, and then defensive stance. I'm assuming you meant guarded stance. Yeah, I'm assuming they meant guarded stance. Yeah. Okay. We'll do Animal Fury. And guarded stance. Which is more AC, which is good. We definitely need we need more AC, so that's good. Um, in terms of his spells. Shield, magic weapon, magic missile, true strike, level two spells. Okay. But magic, magic Mist will be good for him. Just because, I mean, it's nice guaranteed damage on super high level stuff. Um, shield. Oh. Okay, let's get Shield and Magic Missile. Oh, we don't get a, a rank 2 yet. Okay, that's fine. What's my current tank AC? Well, funny enough, like, I, I'm... I'm trying something new right now because my main tank, Sela, is not in the party. I'm now using him. So my I technically my main tank AC is is 37-ish with her, and he's only down at 30, but he's not fully buffed right now. Um So we're still I'm still kind of figuring out how I want to do about this. Or how how I want to do it. Yeah. This is his mythic level three. So we're looking at abundant casting for him. All right, next up is... Melia. Her 10 is... Titan Wolf Suspect or Righteous Might with this. Okay, Hex Secret Heightened Spell. Okay. Two and... Heightened spell. A heightened spell has a higher spell level than normal. Unlike other meta, meta magic feats, heightened spells actually increase the effective level of the spell that it modifies. Any effect depending on the spell level, such as saving throws, are calculated according to the heightened level. Cool. Okay. <clears throat> what myth pack did we uh, did we pick? We picked angel. Yep, we picked angel. Our level three second spirit nature. Shaman who selects the nature spirit takes on an appearance that reflects the aspects of the natural world she has the closest connection to. A nature shaman from the forest has a green tinge to her skin and hair and eyes sparkle with emerald and the scent of green leaves and flowers about her. Ooh. Well, that sounds nice. Okay, we get storm burst. Okay. <clears throat> See you, Sithar. Have a good one, bud. You can trust me. And she's getting a lot of skill. One enemy creature with a DC 16. We plus her charisma modifier, which is only one though. 
Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. I am running out of stuff for her. <laughs> I need I need more I need more spots. I need more spots stat. I do. I do. Uh let's pop. Yeah, we'll keep that. Right, this should be on our bar though. This really should be on our bar. Pop that up there. It summons at the end. Actually, we'll put thorns at the end because that doesn't last long. Okay, cool. Okay. Next up, Mr. Lan. Mr. Lan. Uh, ranging shots, awesome. And bless and magical vestments for buff for buffing Letho and prayer. Okay. Are we in trouble yet? Mm-hmm. More athletics, more perception. Perception. Mm. A rank one. I'm going say, did it recommend what? Oh yeah, just bless. Okay, I don't know. Well, I guess we can clear out some of the, the dots with that. Magical vestments for Letho. Okay. And prayer. Cool. I'm starting up a new restaurant that serves curry poured over french fries. It's called Curry on My Wayward Spud. And yes, there'll be peas when you are done. You got new spells now for each level from the nature domain. Okay, cool. Thank you. Um, ranging... Where, did we already get ranging shots on him? We already got ranging shots on him. Now do we get community domain impossible domain? What what we did something backwards here. Because we haven't gotten his community domain spell yet, I don't think. So, hold on. Extra mythic ability, impossible domain community. Once in the community, once per day, you can make the fight. Okay, yeah, this this is where we, we went backwards because we couldn't use it yet with... We're getting, we might as well go ahead and get this, I guess, for now. But we can't use Guarded Hearth until 8th level. Which is not now. Our level is only... Uh, what is it? Like 6? 5? No, now it's 6. 7 now. It's 7. So we could get this now since we're going to be using it next level. Hey, Mr. Chicken Ninja. What's up, buddy? Um, the only other thing we could do is get Deadly Aim Mythic, maybe? And then save this for the next level. And until then, we do get other stuff. We get Comic Touch and such. But we'll probably do that for now. Let's go ahead and do that. You probably you might get the next level before the next Mythic anyhow. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. And we got Comic Touch. Meditate on your mistakes. Might make you feel better. This stuff down here. Bring down investments, bring down you. How much is this lasting now? One minute per level? Okay. We'll pop that up there. Great. Next up, Nenio. Huh? She's probably doing their spells as I do this too. But that's okay. Loud kill and fire snake. Ooh. Scroll casting, especially when she makes herself is bonkers. Use on spells like web, pits, etc. DC spells. Okay. We can also take her expanded arsenal for the school we didn't choose before. Ooh, so many options. Oh, wait, that's for this. That's for this. Okay. 
we're gonna get improved abundant casting on her which is gonna be great oh yes what yes oh yes oh yes great 